In June 2011, I joined the Archbishop of York Youth Trust, a charity founded by Archbishop Sentamu with a vision to empower young people to transform society. When I began, I was tasked with writing an award for young people, something that would help them to grow in their leadership and their character, whilst also providing them with practical opportunities to reach out and serve others. If I'm honest, I felt pretty nervous as I began writing and piloting the programme with young people across York. I remember driving into work most days saying, Lord, you've got to help me with this. I don't really feel like I know what I'm doing. Despite having a background in youth work and education, I was still nervous and I would ask, is this really going to work? Will it make a difference? Do I even have the skills necessary for the task? But then I'm reminded that throwing ourselves on God when times are uncertain is just what he wants us to do. And during those years, I regularly held on to the promise we read in Proverbs. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge him and he shall direct your path. Nine years on and through the grace and favour of God and our fantastic staff team, the Young Leaders Award has now reached 100,000 children and young people. In fact, in the past two years, some 20,000 young people completed an incredible 100,000 hours of volunteering and social action in their communities. Take, for example, the story of Amelia, a secondary school student who set up a social enterprise for the homeless in her community. She even convinced 47 of her peers and seven school staff to sleep out one night so that they could experience something of what it is like to be homeless. It's just so inspiring when young people use their leadership, their compassion and their creativity to transform issues in our society. And this is still the case even now in this current crisis. It's been a real honour to serve uh, Archbishop Sentimu and Margaret and to be spurred on by them in this vision. What started as a small trial is now reaching out to young people across the entire country. And I'm most grateful for Archbishop Santamu's example, reminding us of what is possible when we trust in the Lord with all our heart. <laughs>